I'm Will Olean with Oneida Vineyard and Eagle Crest Vineyards on Hemlock Lake in the western Finger Lakes of New York. Our vineyard is the oldest premium winery operating in the Finger Lakes. It's our 142nd year. Got started during the American Civil War. I'm a private business owner. I'm a constitutional conservative. I'm not your typical activist. I believe in private property. Uh, I'm more of a libertarian than anything else, and I believe to let people live and let live. But uh, I draw the line where people risk my livelihood, my way of life, my friend's way of life, and the precious and protected Finger Lakes of New York State. I'm here today on Seneca Lake, one of the 11 Finger Lakes in upstate New York, to make a final stand opposing the plans of Crestwood Midstream to store flammable uh, methane gas and liquid propane and butane gas in the abandoned salt caverns uh, on the shores of Seneca Lake. We're just north of the Pennsylvania shale play and they want to make the Finger Lakes, which has been wine country for 150 years, into the gas station for the Northeast. And uh, it's rumored that they want to store gas here that they'll actually use for export for sale overseas. These salt caverns are not seismically stable. Uh, there's evidence to show that there's been erosion of uh, roof walls and other things that make them unsuitable for gas storage. In point of fact, gas storage in salt caverns only represents about 7% of all the storage for gas in America, yet 100% of the accidents occur in salt caverns. My primary frustration is that the people that have been elected to represent us seem deaf to our concerns, and they seem to be in favor of Crestwood Midstream and their plans, and it's hard for me to understand what their allegiance is to a Texas-based multinational company. The people who elected our leaders and pay their salaries right here are providing vocal, local opposition to this.